Hey, 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 everyone. Welcome to the Bizarro Zone with your truly Bizarro. Now, this time, I don't have an opening video for you. However, we all know what's coming, all of us Yu-Gi-Oh fans. In about six days from now, the Megaton finally drops. And lucky for us, lucky for you guys, I'll be able to do a, a tin battle against my buddy Ghostly Openings when that arrives. But, before that happens, I thought that maybe... Maybe we should have some type of deck profile to prepare Dragoon in the event that we do, we do manage to capture him and use him for our own. Although, that's one thing I would like most out of the Megaton, but that's just me. But anyway, I'm gonna bef today I'm going to show you, later in my next video I'll be showing you a deck profile that I used. It's a little bit on the lengthy side of the deck profile, it's like 50 cards, but it works really well. And I think in a matter of a few turns, you can take someone out. Let me show you what I mean. So, I'm going to mill. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So, this is actually pretty good. Because, listen, if you do manage to get uh, Dark Magician on your side of the field, you can use Eternal Soul. So, first, I would set Eternal Soul. Set uh, Secrets of Dark Magic. Normal Summon, Magician's Rod. Magician's Rod activates where you get to add a spell or trap that lists Dark Magician in its text. Normally it's good to get Magician Circle, but it, in this case I would get Magician Circle because I don't have it. Activate Circle. Uh, let me do it this way. So Activate Circle. And you know this is Eternal Soul, and this is Secrets of Dark Magic. So. I know it's a little bit small in my camera. Maybe I'll get another camera later on in a year. Okay, so with that being said, let me continue. I'm shuffling up the deck real quick since I searched. Let's see my opponent cut. Okay, now I mill the top three. And I get to add Dark Magical Circle, so I get to do that again. But at this point, it's fine because guess what? I pulled Apprentice Illusion Magician as one of those cards. So that's good enough. So I'll set one and my turn. Now, normally I would do a turn combo, like one turn combo, but this is what you do. Um, this is what we can do at this time. So, what would happen from here is they do their turn, Magician's Rod's destroyed. Okay. So now we draw. Okay. Now we got Apprentice Illusion Magician. So we can discard Magician's Rod to Special Summon Illusion Magician. Now I get to search for Dark Magician itself via its effect. But before I go any further, I'll activate Eternal Soul. Once I get it, Special Summon Dark Magician via Eternal Soul's effect. The Banish effect goes off, destroys a monster or card of my choice. There. But... I could go either Verde Anaconda, because if you remember, I already have Red Eyes in my hand, but that's where this comes in. This allows me to Fusion or Ritual Summon, as long as the target of what my choice, one of the subjects that I'm using for Ritual or Fusion, is Dark Magician. So, and what's cool is I can bring them back later on, next turn. But, before we continue, I'm going to activate another Dark Magical Circle to see what we can mill. So, one, two, three. Okay, now I can add Navigation for later. And then I could sift through any of these cards of my choice. And Matra Born's on the top. Alright? So at this point, I'm going to set one card. And activate the quick play, Secrets of Dark Magic. Then I send this from the hand and this from my side of the field. In order to bring out Dragoon. It's true, I don't have Dragoon yet. No one does. Except for po pro play games and some people who manage to get it early. Uh, not trying to shout anyone out, but that, those are the only people that I know physically who have Dragoon. Uh, but th pretend this is Dragoon, okay? So one thing that I would like you to know is, depending on how many normal monsters that you use for the summon, like these two, since there's two of them, you can use all their effects and the first effect to destroy monsters and that you, they burn them for that much attack that they have originally. That you can do twice in a turn, since both of the targets of your choice was was uh, normal monsters, which is awesome. 
So that means if they have two Dark Magicians on their field, you can burn them for 5,000. Then you can also get rid of their Eternal Soul, if they have it, if it's a Dark Magician player. And then all of their monsters are destroyed on top of that. Then this monster gains 1,000 attack, so it's now at 4,000. So then that would mean all you'd have to do is just a sw swing with that, and you'd be able to kill him in just two turns. How amazing is that? Well, I just wanted to let you guys know how it is. And also, for the main fa the ones per turn effect, where you can go and target one card or field that, that is activating its effect, negate it, destroy it, you gain a thousand attack if you're able to successfully do this. Certain cards you can't activate, and, and this card actually does have its drawbacks, for instance. Uh, Red Eyes Fusion is its own bane, but since I didn't use Red Eyes Fusion in this case, which I'll have to say, you have to need more of these in a deck besides Red, Fusion, Red Eyes Fusion. If you use Red Eyes Fusion, if you're not quick enough, someone can call by the grave your Red Eyes Black Dragon. And then if this becomes Red Eyes Black Dragon, this becomes a vanilla in a matter of in just two turns instead of it being all-powerful. That, and you might not even be able to summon it at all because your Red-Eyes Black Dragon was called by, you know? So that's why you gotta be careful. But if you do manage to bring it out, it's tough to get it, get it uh, destroyed or stuff like that. But it's still in trouble with Kaijus and such like that. But as long as you have the normal ways of keeping it out, and you can get rid of their big monsters and negate, then that means you can survive the duel and you can win the duel with this. Anyway, stay tuned for the deck profile that I'll be posting for my Dragoon deck. All right, see you guys in a bit. Peace.